Gobis are teaching, there's an, there's an element here, there's an emotional element that the Gobis are moving with, a certain psyche, a certain psychology, and a certain heart. So that's what it means. We hear terms, we read terms, we discuss in the Mandri Bhavu Pasana, when one is following Rag Bhakti, he is supposed to be Bhav Tadatmiya, Bhav Tadatmika, Bhav Tadatmika with the Bhav of Radharani or your Yuteshri, elite, like Vishaka or Lalita or Rati Mandri, Tulsi Mandri, Rupa Mandri, or, or Guru Saki, or Param Guru Saki, or Radharani. So this, especially Radharani, because the Mandris are Radhasneya Adik. So they, they follow the lead. They follow the lead. They want to, the Mandris are like the, the Chaya, Radharani Chaya. Radharani is a Vastu, and the Mandris are the Chaya. So they, they're Mandris, the Upasakas, Radha Krishna Upasakas, the Mandris, we are Bhav Tadatmika with the heart of Radharani. We want to know, we have to know what Radharani feels, what Radharani wants. Uh, without, without, she doesn't have to say, she doesn't have to speak, she doesn't even have to give some in, in Gita. In Gita is interesting, it's a Sanskrit word, in, in Gita, which in English means indicate. We say she doesn't have to indicate. In Gita means moving her eye, moving her brew, moving her eyebrow or, or glancing. Nothing needed. The mantras are so much with Radharani's bhav. Her feelings, the slightest feeling of what does Radharani need, what is she, wh where, what leela she needs, where she, what leela she want, how how I should serve her and bring her to Krishna. This is the mood. So as the, this is part of the sadhana that we're developing. So that's why we have these role models that's showing the hearts of the gopis, and these leelas, these leelas are about prem leela, the prem leela of Radha Krishna. Prem Srup, Sri Krishna, Prem Mai Radha, and the Gopis. So when the Gitas, the Gits, the Gits of the Bhagavatam, the Veno Git, and the um, Veno Git, Pranaya Git, and this um, Gopi Git, and Viraha Git, and then there's Brahma Git, and Mahishi Git. Mahishi Git is with the Dwarka queens, but there's some, we can learn some things about Samanjasa. The, go, the queens of Dwarka have what is called Samanjasa Rati. Their rati is samanjasa, which means a little bit, a little bit of selfishness, transcendental desires for my own pleasure. Whereas the gopis in Vrindavan is samarta, my complete objective, art. My only objective, my only goal completely is Krishna's happiness, Krishna's pleasure, Krishna's satisfaction. So when you, but you can appreciate what you're pursuing or appreciate what you're trying to understand by comparing and contrasting. This is a way of understanding and identifying something. You compare the object and, contra and contrast the object to other similar objects. <laughs>